could win too. Hey. I, I just pulled down this road and all four bulls are just standing in the canola field. We're the bad news. We're the young guns. We're the ones that they told you to run from. Yeah, the player's gonna play and the hater's gonna hate and a regulator's born to regulate when it hits the fan. And it... This is actually a good storm to kill a moose in like this wind. Mm -hmm. I just drove down this no exit road. Uh, we've been watching these bulls. Bradley found them for us. We've been seeing a lot of good quality bulls, but it's just tough to get permission. And we got permission on this side of the road, and we're just trying to track down permission on the east side. Uh, we got four bulls, probably 150 yards off the road. Pretty good bulls. So we're just gonna get gear to keep eyes on them, and I'm gonna go talk to a couple farmers and see if we can get permission. Jesse and Garrett to do a little more scouting where we figured we watch these bulls here but they uh they bedded down and there's just a cow feeding still so they're just bedded in these willows up here so they'll probably be there for most of the day but we had some other hunters scouting around so we wanted to kind of dibs these ones here for now but hopefully Jesse and Garrett find bigger bulls and permission but for now we'll wait here Maybe uh, take a little nap. Oh. No, nope. just that cow again, but they sure do disappear in there. Yeah, we'll just hang out here for a bit and see what happens. Oh, Got we're it. going moose hunting. Is that an astronaut? Guts. No. Oh yeah, guts. That was a good like. Fucking Take one off your knees. Actually, though. Or, or even like this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Robin Longstride. That's a good shot. Watch it. It's all in the hips. Dead. Dead. Yeah, you're sending them in there. Just so we don't spook them too bad. Yeah. And then we can kind of make a plan. I wonder if they were trying, maybe they were trying to run back to their trees here. <laughs> no, I think, well, they're just bedded there. That one guy was just coincidentally standing up. Yeah. I don't think they were moving out of there because the other ones were laying right by him sleeping. Because we Our, have permission in here. This oats here? Yeah. Yeah, that, even that one, whatever one that one was, is bigger than the one hanging on the wall. That's the wide one. Was that the wide one or is that the one that we it didn't, didn't see have this morning? It didn't have much for fronts going It's the wide, wide one, no fronts. We might curl back around and go back to that old. Yeah, keep eyes on them, but at least we can see them now, that's nice. You, you have this one. My yeah, get a look at them, see if you like them. I think we should go set up for he's him. He's running eh? again. He's fucking running. Because he's going right to where we can hunt. Well, he's going to be there in like a minute. What, do you want to beat him there or do you want to weekly guys down? Sorry. No, we want to beat him there. But we'll be into the wind, won't we? Why is he in such a fucking hurry? Because he's weird. in the wide open. I so think. are the other ones. He's, well, like, they feel comfortable in the canola, I think. Like, he's... He's blind, I think. He doesn't know where his buddies went. Should we do something about this bull, or...? Okay, another 50 oh, yards wait, away. Oh, wait, what's that up in the wheat up there? That's what I was saying, maybe a deer. Or that, I guess that doe was bouncing around earlier. Okay, let's go from here. Okay.
smoke them. You stock them. The arrow's right in them, perfect. Let's watch them. What happened? It's just coming. Me and Lucas just started barrel rolling out of the way. It's like exhilarating, but I feel so bad about it. Fuck, man. It's no different than shooting with a gun. It's gonna. These I are do lose a bigger wound. I, know, I can see him. Plan. I can see him right now. So let's just hang out. Let him lay down. Do you want to just walk back to the truck? Well, let's just hang let's out just here. Where we can, well, let's just watch him. Like we're not bugging him here. No, he ain't going. Yeah, let's just fucking rise. I didn't. That's you, buddy. That was you. That's a tap in from here. But I didn't know. I, when I, when I, where, when I, the interrelation to you guys right, right here. there. You, I didn't know. It looked to me like there was a bit of a dip. Yeah. And we thought maybe you guys were waiting for him. And I was like, he's not going to shoot him in his bed, but I wonder if Nate's going to wait for him to get up on his own. He got up yeah. on his own. I think something was bugging him. Cause he yeah, kept, you, yeah. Yeah. I had to recheck, though, because I thought. It was like, I mean, he's, where did you stand? Just in this break right here. Yeah. Look, there's a little bull in there that I can see. Like, here. that's why I thought he was still Did alive. I shoot the correct one? Yeah. <laughs> yes. There's like no a spike in there. Well, that there's a, that deer started coming back on me and Lucas. Something was grunting at us. Or think, you think? And he's hanging out because his buddy probably just died, and that's why he's not leaving. Like, hey, bud, don't <laughs> sleep here. <laughs> this is this is my house, eh? <laughs> what the fuck? Get out of my house, man. You're very clearly wounded here. You had a run in with the great Sheenwa, didn't you? Long dong she Long Dong Sheener. We got we got two fucking we got two brain injured people and two leg injured people on our crew here. Quite a pair of things a lot of fucking work. We hardly crawled seven hundred yards on our knees. And then I held it. Back. You pulled back so perfectly. I didn't even know you pulled back. Cause, Cause like, he like started to get up and I was gonna say like pull back and all of a sudden Well that's what I wasn't sure because like I didn't I think you didn't maybe want to tell me what to do, so when, when you kinda moved you, you kinda went like I this. went like this because I, I, like, I thought he wants me to share. <laughs> well, I like moved because I seen a bow and I was like all of a sudden it's gonna like my ear's gonna go with the arrow. <laughs> let's, go, let's go look at the blood here. You shot him right here. Yeah, it's a moose. <laughs> oh wait, that ain't a moose. <laughs> you have your moose. Do you have right? a quiver? Can you put these <laughs> in that quiver? Mm -hmm. yeah. Rather than me carrying these around. Mm, that does taste like it. It's yeah. gonna be good steaks. Hold that. He's dead. Like like he's over there, piled up, guaranteed. This yeah, is... we'll have lots of time. Well, when you we'll, do... we'll load him whole in the truck. Fucking A. And... She <laughs> buddy. I could see his like ears shaking and oh, knew he yeah. was getting up and Gary was just <laughs> I was But like, then yeah. I had to look again because I swear I was like, that's looking too good. There's but a the fucking problem, tree the, in the way. The hard thing is especially like even for like experienced bull hunters, like you get looking at something through that peep and you sort of lose focus on what you're looking at. Yeah. Like where in the animal you're looking yeah. at. He, that's about as good as a shot gets because he was quartering to us. And you stuck it, and like I think you smacked that lung and maybe like the if, liver, if which you is perfect. Had a, if you would have had the you know, elite, you no, would have went right through the other shoulder. <laughs> like it's like a different bow. Yeah, no, but like no. it's it's fine that you shot it with the one you had, but yeah. <laughs> He's dead. We could walk up to him right this now. This is where me, this is where me and Lucas turned him back. <laughs> well, look at breaks. <laughs> you should let him run you over for the video. <laughs> I thought yeah, he was the video's kind of cool how you just barrel out. We talk about it because I was like. Make sure when he stands up and they shoot him, he's come, probably coming right down the pipe. Yeah. 
So we get up. <laughs> <laughs> Gave uh, Garrett's bull about an hour. It was leaking pretty good. We have no doubt that it's down. There's a little bull in there. When Garrett's bull ran through and didn't push it out, he just stayed there and didn't keep going, didn't continue through the field. So we think that's a good indication that Garrett's bull went down and we'll lock the truck up. And yeah, we'll just, I don't know, what do you say? 700 yards probably, probably 700 yards from the bull. We're gonna walk up there, make sure he's dead, take care of him, get some tags on him, get some pictures and get to work. Uh, we're uh, we're just here. We found Garrett's bull. We let it. Uh, we left it a little while. Um, we kind of watched it, and it looked like it was sort of headed this way. So uh, we're out in this wheat field, and coincidentally, that's where he uh, finally slowed up enough to meet his maker. But anyways, now we got a little bit of a chore ahead of us. It doesn't look like it's too deep. They're out there, out about to their knees. So. Uh, they say this is when the work begins, but this time I think we really got our work cut out for us. Well, here we are. Got Garrett's bull out of the lake. Everybody pulled their weight, to say the least. Got a little muddy, but we got him out, get a couple pictures with him, and start breaking them down. We'll quarter them. I leave the hide on them, keep it clean, and we don't have packs. We're kind of underprepared. We figured a prairie hunt would be easy. But let me tell you, it wasn't. Found the only body of water for 10 miles. Went for a swim, and here it did too, and we got him out. And now, an hour we'll be back at home eating some back straps. Maybe two hours. <laughs> Get that hair over there. How's that cape coming along here? Oh, it's good. This is uh, how the ta local taxidermist likes it. So most guys would like, do a Y from here to here and back. But you I, just, you just cut a section. Yeah, I, I prefer starting here. It's easier because I'm right-handed and get in the back. I, I like getting the nose out of there. Yeah. And then, inst like, I know guys like having their bases tight, but I like leaving a little hair there, so. Protection. Yeah, and it. It just, like, when you put it back together. It looks a little more easy. natural. Yeah. If you can uh, just, this line starts here, but I hate doing things even. <laughs> Especially with. The other well, if it's even, then you can notice <laughs> you it. can't tell what side's not. which if you do it even. <laughs> yeah, so there, and then. Most guys don't know this trick. Yeah, you can but take chunks off. No, yeah, I go right. this sometimes. No, you don't. <laughs> no, right. yeah, it's save, kind of a puzzle. That, save that, yeah. I like messing with the taxidermist a little. We all, it was a one-eared moose, as you can see too. It's missing one of its ears. That's why we got it. It couldn't hear us coming from its right side. That's probably what did happen. Should, but... Got them all washed up. Got a little bit of blaze on that other side. 